Hi, good evening. I just have a quick question for you. Do you ruminate from your past? I know that um, we were brought up in this world with a mindset that what happened in the past defines us who we are as a person. It's actually far from the truth and it's not actually that how it works. And it's actually our past ones ought to be na um a comp should be a compass towards our contribution maybe to other people or to our family and to other people and for us to grow we should not identify ourselves through this past pain experiences and but rather we use this as a learning vehicles to help us to get to know ourselves better and further and to see um and to become a better version of ourselves so it is in our pain um, from the past that we deepen our appreciation uh, for what is good and for what's beautiful. And suffering doesn't need to define us um, who we are as a person. And um, yeah, uh, I certainly have um, have some um, pain points in my life in the past and um as i learned in the woman's school um those past experiences were hurting but um it's actually um if you think about it and because life happens to us and not uh, life happens for us and not to us it means that um some things are happening for a reason it's not just an accident but it's really meant to be happening to us and there's a lesson behind that and um yeah so my past now i could see my sacrifices and my sufferings i turned my wounds into gifts which i could share um to other people who have um who have suffering um, maybe similar as mine similar from my experiences and I could share how I overcome it and I could share how um, the strategies or how I healed from my past so I could say that our sufferings from our past doesn't define us who we are and we we are a woman we are a woman of a future of a vision and that we're not the woman of the past. So um, thank you so much. Bye.